Hi guys, it's Lance with Rainbow Guys DIY. Uh, we went on a little bit of a Goodwill outing, and we got a whole bunch of stuff that's not a plant pot, but we're going to make it a plant pot. And we're going to be drilling drainage in the bottom, because not a single one of these has a hole in it, and drainage is incredibly important. Um, it's also, it's not difficult by any means. We even got a hippo. Her name, their name, his name? whatever, um, is head big, and we're going to put an inch plant in there. Congratulations if you understood that reference. Um, anyways, tangent. <laughs> um, we are going to drill holes in the bottom of these pots. I also got this really nice plain one that I'll demonstrate on. Um, we'll throw up some pictures of what all you need for this. <clears throat> this is not a difficult process by any means, as long as you actually have the right tools and the right supplies for it. Um, We'll demonstrate first on this one, and then kind of breeze through all the others. So let's get started! You'll need a power drill, glass or tile ceramic drill bits, masking or painter's tape, and of course, pots that don't have holes in them. So the first thing you want to do is put a piece of masking tape on where you are going to be drilling. Do this on the inside and outside of the pot, especially if the pot is glazed. This will prevent the glaze from tearing out and it will prevent the clay or porcelain or whatever material you're using from breaking under the weight of the drill. Next I'm going to take my drill and put the ceramic drill bit into it. Uh, I forget which brand of drill bits we got here, but we can flash those down in the description. You see, just normal, fits right in. I think here we are using a three-quarter inch. Now here you want to make sure that you have it under gently running cold water. This will keep the drill bit from overheating, and it will keep the ceramic wet so that it doesn't get all powdery and there's not a huge cloud of dust. Now you don't want to use really any force or pressure. You want to let the weight of the drill do the work for you. If you put too much pressure on, you're going to smash your pots all over the place. And if you're doing it this way, all those parts are going to go in your sink. And we break through. Now you go ahead and collect any plugs or bits that may have fallen out. You can see the little plug probably not going to focus. Nope. And there you have a hole. This will allow water to drain through the soil of the plant when you go to water it, which will prevent conditions like root rot, fungus gnats, all sorts of things. Uh, we're going to speed up a little bit and keep going. We'll show you the rest of what we got. If you like this video, please be sure to give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends. Also be sure to subscribe to our channel and click the notification bell so you don't miss out on any of our new videos. You can also follow us on social media at Rainbow Guys DIY for even more content. See you.
you next time. What if I like just like stack them all like crazy wild? But oh my god, look at all these pots I got. You're ridiculous. I know. Should I do that? I'm filming already. Okay. <laughs>